Hi, dear viewers, this is Arash Kamali with another session of the website programming course on the Python programming language and the Django framework. A very warm welcome from me. If you remember, in the previous session, we learned to delete and erase the news, but we only managed to delete the news alone, and the file that we had uploaded along with the news remained behind and the image we had uploaded for it remain in the media folder. Now we want to delete the news and the image simultaneously. I have deleted all the news already and there is no file in the media so that we can test here. Now I add a news, for instance, news1, cat1, and let's see how it works demo and an image and adding a news now my news has been submitted and if i check my site over here it has been sent on the media folder for me all right now we go to the deleting section over there and improve it a little bit here what we did was to delete the record now we want to do something else which is the deleting of the image before doing so and before deleting that is deleting the record we want to erase the image as well to do so i need to change the filter to get because i am going to need the pk field here and before deleting the record i need to write two lines of more codes uh, two more lines of codes here from fs that is the function uh, i make another object from file system and image delete fs delete what should it delete for me b yeah pick name now what did i do i change this query from filter to get when it is get i can access all the fields and then i made an object from file storage and then in the fs.deletev the query that i had b.peak name and then b.delete i use this query for deleting the image and then deleting the query itself now let's test the query how by refreshing the page here and hit delete the record of my news is deleted and when i check the media folder the image has been added thus anytime we delete a news the image is going to be deleted but as we mentioned before if it is get and uh we say it sends an unrelated pk we are going to get an error but if we use the filter even if we were working with different numbers of bks it won't give an error so we need to do something so that this part does not produce any error we can do something here and write the function and say try and accept use and try and accept to get rid of the problem accept show an error all right and say uh, for instance for instance uh, something should be written over here wrong that's right so that's how we manage this part so that if it could delete this well uh, if it couldn't it would give an error there uh, that there is something wrong that would be the content of the error and it is not going to give a coding error here i add another news with a specific fillings okay uh, to see if there is no interference in other parts i go to the media folder this image has been added and now my news was deleted and the media folder was deleted as well if it couldn't delete or find the pk it would go and give us an error all right now the other two parts that were left need to be completed we copy these two lines of codes copy we go to the adding section 
of our code where we added the news where is it yeah right here and here we say if there aren't any images is that right if there are no images give this error the file not supported would be our error it need to delete the file so here control b here we have the codes and we say make copy from file system and delete file name is that right oh we have already saved it in pick name pk name but we have it here as well so we directly can just say without no interference delete the file name for us so here we say if there aren't any images it deletes the file and gives us an error that the file is not supported here again i make a test file in the desktop that's right and use it as an image and see what happens test.txt and write hello and now my file has been made you notice that although it gave a type file error but it saved the media folder nevertheless now uh, as we said if there was an image type deleted and then show the error let's test it to see if it works properly yeah a name is given a category and now choosing the file test.txt and your file not supported is being shown the file has not been saved yeah okay and as you see over here we set the same here so that if the size was too large the file is going to be deleted and the error is going to be given as well all right that's it with the settings for deleting the file for the deleting section is almost done uh, we have set the delete and add section next up we are going to deal with the editing of the news